Hey guys, uh, I've got an unboxing for you here. This is a uh, Sabrent toaster, hard drive docking station, also known as a hard drive toaster. Uh, why? Because you actually stick the hard drive in the top of the uh, docking station and you can kind of uh, somewhat hot swap it. Um, not really, but it's easier than putting it in a, a, an external um, hard drive case. So this unit is compatible with uh, Windows, uh, OS X, it's USB 3.0, but it's backwards compatible to uh, you know, USB 2. Um, plug and play, of course they say, it uh, handles uh, 2.5 inch uh, and 3.5 inch hard drives. 2.5 inch is obviously the, the laptop hard drive, and the 3.5 inch is the, the computer hard drive. Um, This would be uh, the 2.5 inch, it's just out of a laptop. So, uh, let's see, anything interesting here? It kind of shows you the connections, you stick the hard drive in, um, you plug it into your PC or your laptop and you're good to go. Um, it does up to 5 gigabit uh, per second data transfer at USB 3.0. It's hot swappable apparently, that's kind of interesting, I don't know if you can... I don't know if hot swappable actually means I can stick the hard drive in and yank it out at any time. Maybe, uh, if that was the case, that's pretty cool. Um, this comes with a docking station power adapter and the USB cable. And uh, it shouldn't require any software, I don't think. So, uh, so yeah, I'm going to open it. I haven't even taken the plastic off it yet. <coughs> And the reason I'm getting this is because I have a bunch of old hard drives for my laptop which aren't dead, uh, but which have data on them and I need to erase that data. And I didn't really want to buy uh, a hard drive enclosure because then I'm stuck to either a 3.5 inch hard drive enclosure or a 2.5 inch hard drive enclosure. Um, now on the 3.5 I could probably uh, jam a SATA 2.5 inch in there, but it would flop around. It's not ideal. Um, plus, it means I have to open up the hard drive enclosure and uh, stick hard drives in and out when I'm flipping between 3.5 inch and 2.5 inch. So, I've always wanted a toaster, and uh, it just so happens I almost had to have one for um, the restore I was doing on my MacBook when I installed my SSD. So, what you see here is a slot here, this is for the 2.5 inch, and then the door actually flips down uh, for uh, um, the uh, 3.5 inch. So this is uh, just SATA, it doesn't have the old um, uh, power connections here, uh, for like the IDE power connections I guess it's called. So this just goes like this, <clears throat> stick that in, and I push it down firmly, it doesn't feel like it's sitting in there properly, oh there we go. So that's that's all it looks like. Just go like that, and like I say, it does the uh, the bigger hard drive as well, which I which I do have. But uh, <clears throat> I'm sure you trust me that it fits. So on this one, there's just a big power button on the front of it. Um, not much to see. Um, it's a 12 volt power supply, which is kind of nice. It's got the USB uh, port there. Uh, let's see what else comes in here. There's probably some documentation. Not easy to get out. Alright. So we got the uh, manual. Who cares about the manual? Tells you how to plug in the hard drives. SAT interface. Yada yada yada. And you got your USB cable. And your power supply. So that is it. Um, what I'll do, um, I'll probably do a video of me using this and just showing you how it works. Um, but I'll leave this one at that, just the unboxing of the, uh, of the Sabrent. Uh, this was off Amazon. I think this was about 30 bucks. Um, <clears throat> and it came real fast. And yeah, it's good for 2.5 inch and 3.5 inch hard drives. And it just, uh, it's a different, uh, way to, um, plug in extra hard drives that you have for cloning or backing up purposes. Um, it's a lot quicker than having to use a hard drive enclosure which is kind of a usual uh, method of, of uh, 
you know, uh, uh, having a backup drive or, or cloning a drive. So this is real handy if you've got lots of drives sitting around. You need to erase them or clone your hard drive real fast or um, check a hard drive real fast for, for data. Um, mainly what I'm going to use it for is maybe cloning, um, but mainly I'm going to use it for scrubbing my old hard drives so that I can uh, then put them in the garbage and, you know, take them to the the waste facility that deals with uh, technological waste because um, I don't want my data just being out there all over the place. Alright, so that's it. I uh, hope you guys found that helpful and I will do uh, a bit of a review on this and I'll show you how to use it uh, in another video. Okay.